about people asking me here in YouTube I think I've only had like three people ask me about my hair but I mean like out and about like people ask me what I do to my hair because they tell me it looks healthy but I mean I do have a little bit of split ends but even though I diet I do consider my hair healthy even the girl who does my hair she told me that my hair looks super healthy and does not get damaged when I diet so I just figured I would show you guys what I use for my hair care when i shower and everything so if you guys want to see what i use on my hair please make sure you subscribe to my channel and please make sure you turn on that notification bell to get notified every, every time i upload videos and please give it a thumbs up and please follow me on my social media i would really appreciate it and yes let's go ahead and get started okay so if you all see i do have my hair it is quite long it reaches like my kind of like where my waist is is it my waist no not my waist like my hip I don't know what you call it but it's almost touching my butt so if you all see I do have a diet and it's not really picking up in camera but it is blonde like all this right here it is blonde and this is what I and this is what I have on my hair right now it's called the balayage so I did dye it this is the second time that I dye it so the girl that I go with, um, I know her because we work together, like we're in the same place and, um, it's a spa and then we just like rent the stations, like the place. So she does my hair and I really, really like her because I've been wanting to dye my hair for so long and I just never felt comfortable with a person to dye my hair because I'm so picky about my hair and I tell her like oh my god I'm so sorry I know I'm so picky she's like no it's okay you're not picky but I know I'm picky with my hair just because I've had really bad experiences um before when people dye my hair one time they left it green instead of like blonde and it was such a disaster so i got really scared of people dyeing my hair so it really took me a while to find someone to dye my hair and i'm so happy that i found her and she dyes my hair and i really like how she does it so so i am going to show you what i do i do wash my hair every single day I know people say it's bad because it dries it out, but I don't think my hair gets um, damaged if I should every single day. So I do wash my hair every single day because I do nails, I get dust in my hair, I get nail powder on my hair, and I just, like, I don't like to not wash it because I get itchy. If I don't wash it, it's because I have it dry. Like, let's say today, I strain it for the videos and if i don't wash it today i'll just do a ponytail tomorrow but tomorrow i have to wash it like i can't do more than one day without washing my hair and i think i only do that like once a week that i don't wash my hair but i do wash my, my hair almost basically every single day so i'm going to show you my shampoo and conditioners and i say shampoos and conditioners because Actually, shampoos is the one that I have most. So I'm going to show you first. This is by the brand Paul Mitchell. So they look like this. And I buy the jumbo ones. Oh, they're wet because I had them in the shower. You can find these at Ulta um, or any beauty store. Where I buy these, I get them for a discounted price because I do have a license. And the store and the beauty supply that I buy only licensed people can buy it because they give you a price or they're actually cheaper so i think if you go to ulta um the shampoo is 24.99 or 20 something and the conditioner is like 25 dollars, i believe i will list them right here somewhere and where i bought them these two together were 20 dollars. so sometimes at ulta they have like the hair care discount i think there's some 
days that they have like shampoos at a discounted price so i'm not really sure when that is but if you check out if you check ulta um you can find these um super cheap so so the first thing that i have is the color protect daily shampoo and i use color protect because i do want to protect my color and this does have sunflower extract for longer lasting hair color it helps protect against sun damage and it also infuses brilliant shine for vibrant healthy looking hair so and it's a gentle cleanser shampoo it color protects and it helps with like the uv sunlight and stuff and i really like it because i feel like it does like clean my hair so the scent of it it's not it doesn't have a it doesn't have like a super strong pretty scent it just has like a regular clean scent so i really enjoyed this one and then the conditioner as well this one also helps protect against the sun damage detangles and helps straighten strengthen and repair hair and it also and it's also and it also has some flower extract it's a lightweight formula and yes i it's also the color protect conditioner and it res and it preserves color so i really like this a lot too the only thing I don't like about this is that I don't feel like it softens my hair. But I'm going to show you something later on that helps with that. So this is the conditioner. So I use both of these. Okay, so the next thing that I have right here is by the brand Joico. And this is a color balance blue shampoo. And it literally is a blue shampoo. Like, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it is a blue shampoo. What this helps with your hair, if you have blonde hair, it helps remove the... It says here, eliminates brassy orange tones on lightened brown hair. So you can have blonde hair or brown hair if you have highlights. This one helps remove the orange because sometimes when you dye it after a while, it does tend to change color. You, get, you start getting like orangey spots like orange tones in your hair so this one really so this one really helps with that and once again i bought this one where i bought the other ones but they also have it at ulta and actually i do have like a big bottle but i have this one so i just refill it because i don't want to have the whole bottle in my shower so i really like this one because i do feel like it helps so what i do with this one is after i shampoo my hair with the paul mitchell one I apply this one all over my hair and I leave it on for at least five minutes so I just like wrap it up with a little like clip while I'm exfoliating and washing my body and then I just rinse it and then I use the conditioner so I really like this once again because I do feel like it helps with my orange tones like it does eliminate the brass the brassy tones and the orange tones so i use this at least two to three times a week i don't use it every day but i do use it at least two to three times a week and i do leave it on for like i said like five minutes and then i just rinse it off the other shampoo that i have is called not your mother's blonde moment treatment shampoo and it looks like this and this one is a purple shampoo what this one does, it says neutralizes brassiness, gently, gently cleanses, and enhances shine. So it says for natural and color treated blonde hair shades, sulfate and paraben free. So all these shampoos that I use, they are sulfate and paraben free. So that's what I like about them. So once again, this is what it looks like right here. And I just use this one just, just because I like the way it smells. And this is the first, this is actually the first shampoo that I bought because I knew that when you have like highlights or blonde hair, you were supposed to use a purple shampoo. And I got this one because it was a purple shampoo. But to be honest, I feel like the blue shampoo works better than this one. But this one still helps. It has a dark violet pigment to neutralize brassiness and color changing and violet rice for re revitalizing and soothing dry hair. You and your hair will be ready for all of life's moments. So yes, I do find this one that it gives me shine. And like I said, the purple, okay, this is the thing. A lot of people don't know the difference between blue shampoo and purple shampoo. And this is what my, the girl who does my hair explained to me. The blue shampoo helps with orange brassiness, orange tones. And the purple shampoo works for brassiness, yellow tones. So I do get yellowy and orange. So I just mix 
two shampoos so once again i use this one kind of like the other one sometimes i mix both of them so only like two times a week next i want to talk about after um I, sh I after I wash my hair so the first thing that I use is this Garnier Fructis I mentioned this on my favorites video this is a pure clean detangler and air dry plus a lower extract um spray so first of all the smell is incredible so it just sprays like that and what this one does it detangles my hair so I just spray it all over my wet hair and it helps with detangle and it helps with frizz so I apply this one and then after this I apply my this is called the renewing plus argan oil of Morocco penetrating oil penetrating oil it looks like this this is by the brand um organics I want to say it says OGX but I'm pretty sure it's organics so I apply this after that and then I brush my hair and if y'all wondering what brush I use, this is what it looks like right here. This is a detangling wet brush. So it's called Wet and Dry by Cala. I got this at TJ Maxx and it's super affordable. It's like $5 I believe. And I really like this brush. I have not used any other brush ever since I got this because like I said, my hair does get tangled. And I feel like with this one, it helps with the tangles and it does not pull my hair. Like, see that? Like, it just like brushes your hair and it does not... It like kind of like untangles it. So I really like this um, brush. And like I said, um, after I apply all this, after I apply all this, I brush my hair. And I really like this because once again, it controls your frizz. And I also apply a little bit after I strain it my hair. Now, if you're straining your hair, you're supposed to protect your hair from um, the heat. So what I use, I really don't strain in my hair a lot or curl it a lot unless I'm going to do a video or I'm going to go out. If not, I'll just wear a ponytail. Usually, I'm always wearing a ponytail to be honest. So if I'm going to strain in my hair or curl it, this is what I use. And I bought this at Sally's. I don't know if they still have it, but... I'm almost out of it and I need to buy another one. So this is by the brand Beyond the Zone Pro Formula Turn Up the Heat Heat Protecting Serum. So it looks like this. I don't know if you guys have seen this before. And it says it helps shield hair from heat damage. Heat Protection Serum. And yes, this one is around $8. That's what it says right here. It's around $8. And I like this because you apply it all over your hair and it does protect against the heat. It doesn't like make it sticky or anything. So I really like this a lot. And I that's what I use to straighten or curl my hair. And then if I'm going to wear a dry shampoo, you all know the brand Batiste is my favorite dry shampoo of all time. Right now, I actually ran out of all the other ones that I had, and I'm only left with the dark, deep brown, hint of color dry shampoo. I like this because it gives volume, and I actually do feel like it cleans my hair. And it and it cleans like the, it absorbs like the, all the oils and stuff, so I really do like this one. So if I wear a dry shampoo, I usually wear a Batiste brand. Right now, I only have the, the colored one. Or also what I got recently is this... It's also by the brand Organics, and it looks like this. And this is a Refresh and Restore Plus Coconut Miracle Oil Dry Shampoo. Indulge in this island secret infused with coconut oil. And says of tiare and vanilla bean extract. It helps to absorb oil, restore, and revive hair for silky soft island girl hair. That was so much, and I read super fast. Um... <laughs> Oof, I got tired. So I really like this because of the scent and I do feel like also it absorbs oil. But I do prefer the Batiste over this one. But if I wear a dry shampoo, usually this is what I'll use. And it's rare that I use hairspray. If I use hairspray, it's either if I curl my hair or I wear a ponytail and I want to like just have like no baby hairs. But for dry shampoo, I really don't have a... Um, favorite one right now I'm using it's not even a hairspray it's kind of like um let me see if I can find it okay so this is what it is it's not even a hairspray it's a spray gel and it's by the brand herbal essence and it looks like this so it's just um like a spray so I just spray like where I'm where I have baby hair and then I just brush it and that's about it but I usually don't wear any hairspray just because I don't feel I don't like the feeling of it and yeah so this is it for this video this is all that i use for my hair a lot of you 
a bunch of people ask me what I do to my hair. So I just figured I would share this with you. If you guys dye your hair or you have blonde hair, maybe these shampoos will help you. Maybe not, but it helped me. So I'm so happy with that. And if you guys want to try it out, you can always purchase it at Ulta or anywhere that they sell these products. And yeah, this is it for this video. Once again, thank you so much for watching. And until next time, I'll see you guys soon. Bye. Oh, <laughs> oh,